Hello, it's 8.49am on a Saturday, uh, Liverpool are at Stoke today, uh, but I'm not going to be there because I'm cheating on the live bird today, uh, I'm going up to watch Celtic at Celtic Park, uh, making my way up to Glasgow in about 10 minutes, um, and the reason being is I'm going to go and stand in the safe standing section at Celtic Park. I'm going to watch Celtic v Kilmarnock from that section. I'm going to meet up with the lads from the Green Brigade who helped to make that section happen. And I'm going to tell you all about it, uh, whether it's any good, whether it's better, uh, why the safe sending section generates more atmosphere, if indeed it does. All of that kind of thing. Uh, I'm going to document my day. This is my first one. Let's see what happens. Okay, it's five to ten. We're on the motorway. And this here, this man, that's Paddy Howie, who's given me a lift to Glasgow. Because he's a great lad. Um, <laughs> Paddy, what time are we getting there, mate? We're going to be in Glasgow for a one, but the most important thing on any trip to Glasgow is uh, getting the tea best services for half ten for a gourmet breakfast. Haggis on a bab. Is right. We'll update you on that in a bit. Paddy's getting stuck into his breakfast. Have a look at that. Traditional breakfast. Haggis and all. Haggis on there. Uh, but look at this. Look at this for the services. Don't get that when you go into Anfield, you know what I mean? Um, tea Bay services. Bit special, huh? Here's the border. Here's Scotland coming up. The big fucking flag's a bit of a giveaway. Here we go. <laughs> Welcome to Scotland. Hiya. Okay, it's half one and we're in Glasgow. We're here. Um, just about to go and have a pint uh, pre match. Going to this gaff over here Celtic Social Club. <laughs> The safe standing section at Celtic Park accommodates around two and a half thousand fans and was introduced after pressure by fan groups including the Green Brigade. They had to get over a lot of hurdles and through a lot of red tape to get here. It took five years for them to achieve this section, but now it's been hailed as a huge success. Everyone I've spoken to today has said what a great section it is. They've spoke about the colour and the support and the noise it generates and there's talk even now of extending the, the section at a future point. There's also a big waiting list for this section now running into thousands, which shows what a big success it's been. There you go, there's your rail seat. That bit there unlocks for European matches. So you can turn it up into a seat. Today it's locked up because it's a standing section for a league match. Here's Paddy's feet and that's how much room he's got. Here's the man. There's the pitch. That is safe standing. Here we are, we've made the safe standing section at Celtic Park. About 10 minutes to go till kickoff. It's all starting to go off. Flags are out, songs are going, drums are going. It's all the, thing, all the reasons that we've always said why this should happen back home. You can see it here. It's a place for people that want to create atmosphere. It's a place for people to stand up and support the football team. What's wrong with that? Like minds of people in a safe place watching the football. score was 3-1 to Celtic, we uh, had a great afternoon in the safe standing section, loads of singing, loads of shouting, loads of songs, loads of noise, loads of colour and that's what it's all about. So here we are outside Celtic Park, uh, they won 3-1 against Kilmarnock, uh, my first experience of a safe standing section uh, and my initial thoughts are brilliant. Uh, loads of young kids in there, great culture in there of, of songs, of colour, of flags, of scarves, jumping up and down, all kinds of songs all the way through. And, and it was a nothing game this as well, you know, Celtic have already won the league, this, this game against Kilmarnock today was a, 
essentially a nothing fixture and yet the atmosphere all the way through for 90 minutes was brilliant people bouncing up and down a couple of lads at the front with loud hailers just keeping it going all the way through and it was absolutely superb. I, I, I think sections like that should come to England, should should be in the Premier League. You should have the option to stand, to go in a section like that and make a noise and make some colour and, and, and just encourage a culture of, of, of supporting your team that way. Uh, almost like an ultras culture that you see sort of in Europe and that sort of thing. So, yeah, brilliant day. Uh, I've really enjoyed myself in that section. Uh, the Celtic supporters who've helped us today in terms of a ticket, in terms of you know getting us in here and everything else. Thanks very much to them. Big help. Um, really enjoyed my day. And I hope to see something like this at Anfield one day. I really do.